In this video, I'm going to be testing out a mask proof makeup technique. Okay, how many of you ladies are struggling with keeping your foundation on your face? Me, this girl. The nasty truth is all my masks look like this, okay? But there is hope. I hope. I really do. I recently saw a makeup technique by Jackie Ina who claims that your foundation won't budge, won't smudge, and won't transfer. Let's put it to the test. <laughs> Welcome to Beauty Bus, where we test out internet beauty and hacks to see if there's a poop, a whoop, or maybe baby, meaning it may work for some people and it may not work for other people. Yes. The thing is, I was in addressing women. I was I'm trying to say that as fast as I can. You know the drill. Let's get on into it. Okay, I'm on my Period. So we got our little period stash. I'm gonna be munching on this. Get over it, okay? My uterus is at war today. So let's do it. Let's get on into it. My hope is that this video will be my holy grail, your holy grail, to getting the best foundation ever. Okay, while we're at it, Team Millennial or Team Gen Z? Comment below. Who are you? Who are you really? Let me know. Very first thing we're gonna start off with is matte primer. Everything is gonna be mattified. I'm excited to show you the two game changers in all this makeup that you're gonna need right after this is linked down below. I wanna know, are you a middle side gal nowadays or are you swept? You know, I've always been swept and now I feel insecure going out with my little swept hair. I can't believe I'm 20 freaking seven years old. Okay, I'm feeling a little bit old. I saw this funny TikTok of this girl. She's purchasing her liquor and the person literally looks at it, hands it back and she's like, wait, that was a little bit fast. And then they're like, yeah, because you have a 19 in it. Which means you're older. And she goes home and cries. Step one, done. Do you feel me? Or are you still very young? So the goal with all these products, we're gonna stick to matte stuff. So we're done with our primer. That is the weird thing. We are gonna actually set our primer. Don't ask me. This is what Jackie said, okay? Let's follow the queen. Jenna. Girl, that smells good, okay? I also would like to know, flare jeans or skinny jeans? I am all about the flare jeans, okay? I don't know why I ever allowed myself to fit into those skinny jeans. These thighs save lives. I got, got them big old thighs. I got that big old booty, you know? <laughs> I saw this TikTok that was comparing people nowadays, how they dance. By the way, some of you girls on TikTok, I'm like, this is a little much. But then I remember, this is how we used to dance. So we are done with that. Simple, right? We're just changing a few things around, like majorly, but okay. Now we're gonna switch it up again. We're gonna put concealer. Actually, I mean, I guess some people do this, which is fine. Now we wanna stick to products that are mostly mattifying. My skin is very dry, so I'm gonna go with this one. This is the Clinique Even Better All Over Concealer. Freaking love this. And the reason you wanna do this is because your eyes tend to get a little darker underneath. I'm just feeling old nowadays, you know what I mean, man? Now we're just gonna tap that in. I actually find it very interesting because nowadays there's even a trend where you're letting your Dark circles show through. And I'm just like, man, beauty standards and everything's just is constantly changing, which I'm all about, okay? Because I remember, you guys know when like magazines used to come to your house, and all these Victoria's Secrets with like these big old titties, like no wonder I got breast implants at such a young age because I was so influenced by thinking that that's the way I should be looking and why I was ladder than a board. Now I like it. Look at this, this is a vibe. After concealing, we're also gonna contour. I don't really contour anymore, so I'm just gonna skip this step. But this is where the magic happens. Okay, listen up. Jackie recommends this makeup sealer. I purchased this off Amazon. According to everyone on reviews, like this is the best setting spray ever. Water resistant. We'll have your makeup literally on for days. I don't even know what's in this. So we are actually gonna mix that with our foundation. I'm also gonna be using a matte proof foundation. I wore this for my best friend's wedding. Ride, you know, everything and it still stood on. It feels a little bit like glue. So we're gonna mix this in with a spray. We're just gonna spray this on the brush. Tram, tram, tram. Kind of smells like, uh, like mint. Gonna go in. So how are you guys doing during quarantine? How are you vibing? Are you getting into the rhythm of things? I feel like I've finally now learned that I appreciate schedules. I appreciate routine. It gives me freedom. I like waking up, doing my little morning routine, exercising, knowing what time is lunch, you know? I enjoy all of that, making my bed. Whereas before I was like free flowing and I was like, no, this helps with my creativity. And now I'm like, that doesn't help anyone. Blockbuster or Netflix? Tell me girl. If you never got to experience Blockbuster, I feel a little bad for you. It was an experience. Me and my dad, I love you, Pop. He would take me every single Friday. It was like a candy land. Like you got to pick all these movies. There's almost like a scent to the carpet, you know? And then having to rent like so many movies, going home, get in Papa John's, and it was just the best thing of my life. Next step, we are gonna spray our face once again. This has to spray five to 10 inches away from your face lightly. Ooh. This literally feels like glue. This is not good. I recommend you before using this, do your brows. This is gonna work like soap brows right now. Look at that. It feels like glue. Oh my goodness, my brows. 
bam eyebrows eyes we are done now we're gonna go back in with some translucent powder we're almost done ladies we are almost done so far my skin honestly doesn't feel super like tight but it's like a weird feeling like it feels like plasticky it's fantastic. which is interesting i feel like it's all in there so now we're gonna go back in with some translucent powder mm -hmm. Game Boy or Nintendo Switch? Tell me down below. I got so much into Nintendo. Due to quarantine, I have so much fun on Animal Crossing. Thank you, honey, for getting me on there. Spray our face just a little bit more. <laughs> Be careful, it kind of sprays a little thick at times. Tracksuit or jogger set? Let me know. So obviously, our whole face is very mattified. We're also gonna be sure to only use matte lipstick. Now I'm gonna go in with this one by Kristen Dominique. I absolutely love this color. This is in the color Nude Kiss. They are good. <laughs> this is uh, Milani's Luminoso. This has been an all-time favorite of mine. Literally so cheap and so pretty. I'm a huge fan of liquid blushes, but you just can't do them in a mask, okay? And this one gives you a little bit of a glow. Do you see that? I don't even have to apply anything else because I'm all about less is more. All right, so this is the finished look. So now we're gonna test it out, see if it actually worked. One other fun little hack before we do that is these little guys. These are called 3D mask brackets. I saw Chloe Morello talk about this and I was like, that's pretty genius. It's just a little barrier that you attach to your mask. And what she did, which I thought was really smart, is she took some of her powder, she just added it on for extra protection. I kinda like that. All you gotta do is just attach this on into the little curves. This reminds me of my last video, okay, where everything went wrong. I did a little hair thing. This is one of the success. This is a way to get an easy hair bun, literally under a minute. You can check out that video over here. Ay, ay, ay. Finally. All right, there you go. It just kind of attaches in the crevices of your mask. It ain't perfect, girl. This is cheap, okay? And then shabam. Feels quite comfortable. I could take this to rock climbing. I like it. And now we're gonna test this out to see if Miss Jackie was telling the truth. Let's see. I'm gonna rub this all over my face. I'm scared. Girl! I'm literally smacking myself. <laughs> there ain't gonna be no edit so that you could see. Okay, let's see. Wow. The only thing that got on it was my lipstick, but I didn't really set my lipstick, which that's another little hack. A girl. Okay, you need to get this. That's it, this is the magic thing. Per usual, my masks look like this. Ugh. Nasty. And look at this, are you kidding me? I literally feel like my makeup's gonna last all day. It feels comfortable, it feels beautiful, and that's what's up. If you enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up. If you didn't, give it a thumbs down. If you haven't subscribed, subscribe. I hope you have an amazing day, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye. What am I doing with my life?